Well, now, here's a nice transistor radio from about 1960, kind of Toshiba-like, and with a Toshiba-like model number, 7TR800. But it's also kind of Hitachi-like in its construction. Let's have a good look at this radio and find out, like, what it's, like, really like. This radio is on the upper end of what could be called a shirt pocket radio, and it is in the horizontal configuration. It has handsome styling and is a two-band radio, AM, or what they call medium wave, and short wave. With short wave, a pocket radio typically has a rod antenna, and here we have just the remnants of one screwed into the antenna jack on the top. That rod would be stored in a pouch on the back of the leather case when not in use. So, TMK. Who or what was TMK? Well, on the back is molded the words Osaka Onkyo Co. Limited. Well, that helps a little, but not much. This radio has this funny chrome circle disc inset in the bottom. I suppose this could be the same or similar to a radio branded Onkyo that is quite rare and has a sort of tripod stand that mounts to the bottom. In that case, this chrome disc is a plug, a blank, for where that stand mount would go. Or maybe it was an option for this radio too. So let's have a look inside and see what that may tell us about this radio. Well, it's a nice piece of work, nicely constructed. We don't see any kind of tripod mount on the bottom, underneath that chrome disc. But there is, I suppose, room for one. Barely. It's hard to see because everything is crammed in here so tight, but the transistors are branded Toshiba. I suppose the radio could be Toshiba-made because it does share a detail we see in Toshiba radios. The leads to resistors and other parts have added vinyl insulation on them. Not all of them, though, and on Toshibas, they often insulated everything, even when a part was nowhere near another part. So maybe it's a Toshiba make, but it's just as likely, I guess, that this radio was made by Osaka Onkyo in their own factory. Inside the back, we see this curious name and Chicago address. Lots of radio owners put their address stickers inside their radios, and this looks just as homemade as that. But the name on this one is a company name, Toyomenka, Inc. Aha! I can guess two things from that, that Toyomenka was an importer or sales agent for this radio in the United States, and I'll go a little further out on a limb to guess that this radio's name, TMK, is derived from the name Toyomenka. What do you think? <laughs>